Hello everybody, this is Andrew Roboto here, and today I would like to do a commentary slash reaction video on part two of the Childish Dad video, since there's a lot of them out there, which the first video I'm going to react to in part two is Childish Dad Gets Scared During a Thunderstorm, which this was uploaded a couple weeks ago, and it's actually pretty funny, because <laughs> literally a 35-year-old guy is scared of thunder. Boo-hoo. Ha-ha. <laughs> All right, they're sleeping. Oh, there comes the thunder. Oh, childish dad got startled awake. Whoa! <laughs> His signature cry. <laughs> yeah, what is the matter with you? <laughs> oh my God, thunder's so scary. Duh. No kidding. That's actually true. Most grown men are not scared of thunder, and I am actually one of them. Like with most kids, I used to be scared of thunder when I was a kid, but then when I became a teenager, I no longer became scared of it. And now I'm not scared of thunder. And speaking of being scared of thunder, Dave reminds me of um, John and Ted from the movie Ted, because John and Ted are both 35 years old and they're still scared of thunder. And that's why, and that's why they're thunder buddies. <laughs> to sleep and stop being a baby. No. <laughs> oh, no. Go back to sleep. I can't go back to sleep. I think it's thundering outside. Oh, you poor thing, Wah. Dave. Wow. <laughs> Make it stop. Make, Make it, it stop. stop. <laughs> I swear to God, if you do not shut the goddamn hell up and go to sleep, then I am leaving you tonight and I am also taking the kids with me. Good. You should, Catherine. Because nobody wants to marry a man who is childish or a woman. Because a childish man or a woman would just be crazy. <laughs> I'm sorry, darling, but I am just so scared. Won't you please give me a big hug to protect me from... Give me a big hug, please. Outside? No, I am not in the mood. Your childish antics are really starting to get on my nerves. I don't even know why I am still married to you. It's because you love me, isn't it? Well, no kidding. I suppose so, but I'm warning you now. If you keep up this childish behavior for much longer, then I am leaving you, and I am taking the kiss. All right, Cupcake, you have my word. From now on, I will start behaving like a mature grown man. <laughs> <laughs> I love how the childish dad promises to change his ways and not act childish, and, and he promises to act mature, yet he goes back to acting like a child. <laughs> well, so much for making that promise. The scary thunder is back. Oh my god, that scared me. I want my teddy bear. I want wow, a teddy bear. Wow, so much for promising that you'll start acting like a grown man wow, from now just on. Wow, just wow. I'm sorry, I can't So much for promising that. <laughs> Too funny. Since I, was a kid. I was hoping to have grown out of it by the time I became an adult. Well, it's very clear to me that you haven't grown out of it. Duh, you haven't, you clearly have not grown out of it, Dave. Can I please have a teddy bear? Can, Can I have a teddy bear? bear? <laughs> I have hug whenever I got scared during thunderstorms. <laughs> God, Dave reminds me of Boris when he was drunk, and he wanted a teddy bear when he was on the couch. And he also wanted Doris to tell him a bedtime story, but she refused. <laughs> no! I am not your mummy. I am your wife, and you're a grown man. I am so your wifey for you lifey. <laughs> <after that one. laughs> He's crying. <laughs> Too priceless. Don't protect me, my wifey, for living one. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I have had enough of this. Hey, where are you going? Away from you is the answer. I am going to sleep downstairs <laughs> on the couch as your childish behavior is really starting to annoy me. If you want to <laughs> act like a crybaby during a thunderstorm, then be my guest. Be my oh, guest. Don't leave me. I need you to Her catchphrase. Catherine's catchphrase is be my guest. Outside. Good night, Dave. Good night, Dave. <laughs> Oh my god, he's hiding under the blanket. I don't like it, water. <laughs> Yay. I'm safe under here. Now that thunderstorm cannot get me. <laughs> oh my god, he's so scared of thunder. <laughs> okay, let me just get rid of that ad. I don't know why it's still a thing, but eh, whatever. Okay. Next Shadow's Dad with video we got, which was another. F Recent upload was, um, Childish Dad doesn't want to get his COVID vaccine. Come on, Dave. We are going 
Hold on, let me bring that up and then I can unpause it. Come on, Dave, we are going out. Yay, I'm so excited. So, where are we going today? We are going to go and get your COVID vaccine. COVID vaccine? <laughs> Oh, I, I love how she Here pronounces it COVID vaccine. I don't want to have it done. I'm scared of needles. Understandable, but you gotta you do stop it. Stop being a baby. You need to have it done because it will protect you from the coronavirus and it will stop you from getting really sick with it. What a baby. Now, come on, stop being such a baby and let go. We don't. Well, that is true what Catherine said. It'll, pr it'll protect you from having to go to the hospital and dying from it. That's why this is my message for everybody. Who's unvaccinated? Get the vaccine. It's the only way. It's the only way we're, this pandemic will end, and we will get back to normal. And also, it's the only way for you to not have to go to the hospital if you do test positive. And it will protect you from dying because if you're unvaccinated, then you're vulnerable to death, and you'll wind up in the hospital. So that's my message for you all: get the vaccine if you haven't got it. Want to be late for your appointment? What? You made me an appointment behind my back. Oh. You are so evil. You are evil so evil. Are so <laughs> ugly and stupid. Why? <laughs> wow. This is so embarrassing. How Instead, embarrassing. You can cry and throw a tantrum all you like, but you are going to get your inject. Well, Emma and Bri Emma's right, and so is Brian and Catherine. They're s he is clearly embarrassing everybody. <laughs> whether you like it or not. <laughs> oh my god, he's, here's his signature cry as well flexing. Why are you forcing me to get this stupid injection? Are you trying to poison me, you wicked witch? <laughs> a wicked Cry witch. Out loud? No! I am not trying to poison you, you overgrown man child. <laughs> overgrown man child. Dave is an overgrown man child. <laughs> he's a bodybuilder, but he cries while flexing his muscle. <laughs> I just want you to be protected from the virus. Everybody wants to be protected, protected from the tough. virus. I am a big tough man who needs no protection, you dumb woman. Oh sure, you're a very tough man, Dave. Even bodybuilders like you need need to get the vaccine. In fact, everybody in this whole world needs to get the vaccine. Oh sure. You're oh sure, tough right. you're a tough Standing man, there, Dave. Throwing <laughs> a tantrum and crying like a spoiled little child. <laughs> now, enough with this nonsense. We need to get going. When they arrived at the doctor's office... My God. That wait <laughs> in the waiting room was so embarrassing. Everyone was staring at us. No kidding, Brian, because... Because your dad is acting like a complete child. <laughs> oh my God, that's so funny. <laughs> Even in the doctor's office, he acts like a child. <laughs> well, maybe they wouldn't have been staring at us if a certain someone didn't start throwing a tantrum on the floor. Duh! Like a big baby. I still can't believe Duh, of course they wouldn't have stared at you if you weren't being so a baby. <laughs> For the last time, Dave, this injection is not going to poison you. It's no kidding. From the coronavirus. Once again, the, once again, get the vaccine because it will protect you from having to go to the hospital and dying. And it's the only way this pandemic will end. Good afternoon. Are you ready for your injection, sir? No, get the thing away from me. Sir, you don't need to be scared. The injection will not hurt. Dave wow. is a scaredy cat. Brave, man, scaredy cat, scaredy cat. <laughs> no, I don't want it. That needle looks so menacing and evil. Why? Wow. Oh, just stop it, Dave. And let Vaccines are not scary. Injection. I am so sorry about this. He tends to act like this, well, all the time. Oh, that's No kidding, he right. always acts like this a child. the first time I have seen this. He isn't the first grown man who's been a little scared of having an injection. Now, sir, you don't need to be scared. It will only take a few seconds. I love how the doctor's just all cool and calm when she's seeing a childish dad acting childish. Good on her for acting calm and mature this whole time. To give you your injection. No. There is no way you are sticking the evil needle in your evil witch. Hey Dave, if you be a big boy and have your injection, we'll get some ice cream afterwards. Oh boy. Ice cream. Ooh, ice cream. I love ice cream. Chip. My favorite oh. chocolate. Fuck. Oh, he go. got the vaccine. Okay. What? <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> He's throwing a tantrum on the floor. <laughs> Dear God, I am going to die. What? 
What a baby! <laughs> oh, quite out now, Dave. You haven't been poisoned, and you were most certainly not going to die. Now, get up from the floor. You're not only embarrassing us, but you are embarrassing yourself. No kidding, you're embarrassing yourself, Dave. And everybody in the entire God universe who has met you. <laughs> Another funny video. <laughs> Alright, so let me think. I gotta look back on my phone real quick to see which videos I've already reacted to, because in part one I reacted to four childish dad videos. Give me one moment, I'm gonna turn on the light just so I can find my phone. This. Oh, here it is, my phone's right on my desk. <clears throat> Sorry about that, I had to clear my throat, because it's the flu season. Not only is it the flu season, but it's also the COVID season with this pan with this pandemic happening. Ugh. Anyways, so the videos I've already reacted to. Let me take a look. All right, we already did the one brief. We already did the lunch video. Not picking up kids from school. Wants candy and going to Sun PC. Okay, so those. First, the four videos we did already are Dad acts childish during lunch, Childish Dad won't pick up the kids from the school, Childish Dad wants candy, and Childish Dad wants to go on a son's PC. <laughs> Alright, so next video we're going to react to, which this is the most recent one to be uploaded, and it was uploaded a few days ago, is Childish Dad doesn't want to take a shower. <laughs> you know, I actually said this in the comments on that video, um... Childish dad reminds me of a student who went to college with me who who smells really bad because she doesn't shower. No offense to that person. No offense to that person, but it's it's the truth. You actually do smell bad. And you need to take a shower. Just thought I'd clear that up. Sorry if I offended any one of you, but the truth is some people have bad hygiene like childish dad does. <laughs> Anyways, so yeah, enough about my mi my mini rant. Let's get on the, to the video. Or should oh I say rant? <laughs> mini rant. What sorry. Is smell? Sniff, sniff. What my is that smell? God. My Dave, God! <laughs> when was the last time you had a shower? I can't remember. Probably, probably the last time Childish Dad had a shower was, I don't know. Probably when he probably when he was born. That's the answer. Because <laughs> I can imagine he never took a shower when he was a kid. <laughs> well, I think you need to have one because you. Duh! So you need to, everybody needs to take a shower because because it's the part of having good hygiene. And also, if, no offense, but if you don't take a shower or have any good hygiene, then nobody's going to want to hang out with you. Sorry to offend anybody once again, but that's the truth. Hey. That wasn't very nice. You don't go calling people smelly. <laughs> Says the person who smells really bad and needs a shower. But it's the truth, Dave. <laughs> you absolutely stink and you need to have a shower. Well, that is the truth, but Dave. Sorry to offend to you. Shower. I love being smelly. <laughs> Dave loves being stinky. <laughs> Sorry if we offended you, Dave, but that's the truth. You need to take a shower. In fact, everybody in the whole world does. Men like to be smelly. You can't make me have a shower. Why? <laughs> Signature <laughs> crying. Why can't you just go take a quick shower? Why do you have to kick up such a fuss about it? Exactly. Take a quick shower. It's not that hard. Besides, taking a sh taking a shower actually feels really good, especially if you're stressed or if you're sweaty too in the summer. <laughs> because I want to be smelly. Being smelly. <laughs> he wants want to, to be, be smelly. smelly. I want to be smelly. I want to be Dave, smelly. I want to be so smelly. That it is making me feel sick. So no kidding. Dave, I can imagine Dave smells like beef and cheese. <laughs> Dave, can't you just go take a shower? Please no, take a I shower. Oh, take he's, a shower. he's crying while yeah, flexing. I, <laughs> I love that running gag. <laughs> You're a wicked witch. Why? You're a Dave, wicked witch. I am not being evil. All I'm asking <laughs> is that you take a shower. Because you Please do take a shower. Oh my god. What is that disgusting smell? I love how Brian... I love how Brian's not in the room, yet he can still smell from, like... Dave from, like, a 100-mile radius. And another thing I want to point out is I'm surprised Emma's not in this video reacting her to her dad smelling horrible. 
Sniff, sniff. You, it's coming from Dad. Yes. Duh, because he smells terrible. Really needs to take a shower. Duh, of course he needs to take a shower. (laughs) But as you can see, your father is acting like a big baby. Well, that's no surprise that he's a baby. Well, that's nothing new then. Nope, it's nothing new. He always acts like a baby. Please don't make me take a shower. Please don't make me take a shower. But Dave, you seriously stink and you need to take a shower. So either you get in that shower right now, or I am dragging you up to the shower myself. Please do drag him up to the shower because he needs to take a shower. Why are you so cruel to me, you evil witch? Why? Why is he cruel? Right. Why is he cruel? But does it? If you right. are refusing to take a shower, then I am going to drag you up to the shower myself. Oh, no, no. oh, she's picking up her water. own husband. Nice. This water is so cold. I heard this. Oh, water. please. <laughs> stop picking up such a fuss, Dave. The water <laughs> isn't even that cold. No kidding. I can't believe you actually carried me up to the shower and forced me in here. <laughs> how is a small woman able to pick up a beefcake of a man like myself? A <laughs> beefcake of a man? Well, the answer, Dave, is go animate slash beyond logic, which you should never question. Because I can. Also, you may be a beefcake, but you have the mind. What? That wasn't very nice. Also, can I come out of the shower now? I nope. don't like all this cold water. We don't want you to come out of the shower till you're clean. Absolutely not. You are not coming out until I say so. Which the answer is, the answer is he will not come out of the shower until he is completely clean. What? <laughs> you evil. Well, guess what, Dave? Everyone hates you when you act like this. Duh. Grow up and take your shot like a grown man. Duh, you should grow up. And of course everybody hates when he acts like a child. No kidding. <laughs> Alright, so that's the end of the video. Um, I'm going to end my video so I don't make this video too long. But um, anyways, thank you for watching, everybody. More Childish Dad videos will be in the next video or so. Thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoyed this video. I will end my video here. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.